Hello and welcome to this video in which I would like to show you how you can start a new presentation. I have already opened PowerPoint and you will see that Empower is installed because the Empower ribbon is visible here at the top of your PowerPoint window. And so you can start now with creating and starting a new presentation. How you do so, you will go to the new section within the Empower ribbon and click on the new button here. And then you will see that the window, the Empower library will open up in which you can choose your master, which is in our case, case the Empower Companies default here. You can either then go to the top, to the bottom right and click on create new presentation, or you can simply double click and the presentation based on the master I chose is opened up in a new window. Before we start with filling these slides with content, I will go to the presentation settings. And here you have on a individual company basis, some choices you can make. You can either select the language for us. You can also say whether you would like to have the page number, date and footer included. You can say the confidentiality degree you would like to have within your presentation and also just decide on a few further information that might be available, which in our case are additional guides, slide number, label and watermark. Once you have made the settings for the presentations you would like to be applied, you can simply click OK and all of these changes will be applied to not only the existing layouts and slides within your presentation, but also for all future layouts you might include. How you can include new presentations is if you click the right mouse click and then go to new slide that might be then or will be then included. You can also go back to the new section within the Empower ribbon on top. Go here also to the new slide and choose the respective layout you would like to include. This will then also include it in the presentation and you can fill the different slides with the content you would like to have. I wish you good luck with creating new presentations and hope that this video helped you in doing so.